Hey, 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 it's your girl Natasha over here, the founder and the creator over here at Siobhan Accessories. So we coming to you today with a home DIY. This is the best home DIY ever. Um, as you guys know, I specialize in accessories. So what I do is I bring you home DIYs to make sure that you are able to keep your accessories for years down the road. You do, accessories are not meant to, um, first let me clear up everybody think, because it's fashion jewelry, oh it's not gonna last long. It will last just as long as your sterling silver, your fine jewelry. The catch with accessories is all about the way you care for them. So we're gonna get into this fedora. We love our fedoras. We wanna wear our fedoras everywhere, but sometimes, they get bent up, whether we pack in, in the luggage, kids playing with them, you accidentally have company, they sit on, whatever the scenario is, we want our fedoras to stay in perfect shape. So, as you see, you see how that is smushed up, right? So, this little device that I have, it is about to blow y'all mind. Bam! What we're about to do, we're about to bring this baby back to life, all right? So let's go ahead and get started. You want to start and ease the heat in. You don't want to spend too much time on it because you don't want it to bubble. It's kind of like ironing it. But the blow dryer is just much better. So y'all see how we're giving that life back? So we kind of get it up. So, I kind of like to hit the rim as round, like I say, to kind of give it more of a quick press, flat surface, but do not keep it on too long because it will start to bubble and that's not what you want. So, so far... Let me turn this off so y'all can hear. Do y'all see the difference? Do you see, ladies? Do you see why I am the accessory expert? Like, come, man, drop a, girl, you did that. Girl, you just saved my life. Girl, I get to keep all my fedoras. <laughs> and you would never know this was a smashed hat, would you? Baby, baby. We could probably hit that a little more. <clears throat> like I say, just kind of keep it around. Do not use a steamer and do not use an iron. They not going to work. I already made the mistakes for you. Your blow dryer. God's gift. God created some talent. And that talent created this. So you don't want to get your head pressed. You press your fedora, baby. So then... Once we get done, the key that we want to do next is you just sit it somewhere flat and just allow it to kind of pretty much get its shape back. Um, one of the things that I do do is, let me show you. Hold on. What you want to do is you keep her on a, a, a fake head surface and that's to keep its shape as well. That's to kind of help it, okay? So that way it don't get flattened or anything. Now, another thing that I do Y'all, let's just be honest, black people. Y'all know those little garbage bags that we get from the grocery stores, you know, whatever grocery store you go to, whatever you get your little toiletries at, yes. So you wanna take one of those plastic bags <clears throat> and actually try to sit her in it. Um, if you cannot with the particular bag, maybe if it's too small, just then put the hat. Don't worry about the head, but take some like, um, T not tissue, some newspaper or something to kind of like stuff it. We want to kind of give it like a little ball or something. Something to just keep the shape. But the plastic, it keeps the lint. Because what you do not want to do is use tape. But you can use a microfiber cloth. With the microfiber cloth, you have to be very delicate and gentle. You just take it to do one round. Wop, that's it. But anyways, do y'all see the difference? No wrinkles, and this baby is back to normal. So whenever you get a fedora, and it, for some reason, I mean, we're going into the holiday season. We all know USPS, UPS, they working very hard. Unfortunately, boxes are getting damaged. So you may run across a company that has a, um, 
a return policy that's not that don't meet your needs so this is to help you where you don't feel like oh my god i'm now stuck with a damaged hat you are not stuck with a damaged hat and just remember, do not do it too long. All right, guys, thank you so much. And I will continue to keep bringing you all the DIYs. Share this video. If you coming back as a replay, go ahead and hit replay in the comments when you watch this. Share, share, share. This is something that needs to be shared with us ladies. All right, y'all. Good evening.